Well, hello everybody. How are you? How are you? Yes, my name is Wayne. You are watching Inside Fail On. You once again are here at the Fail On Athletic Club. And you know why? This was actually her bike. I just found out about this a little while ago. Mary Ann Kalor's bike. But we're having a special fundra fundraiser scholarship situation. And I'm going to go inside and chat with a few people. All, all because of what Mary Ann meant to this community. And what she still means to our community. So let's go inside and see what's going on. Good to see you guys again. All right, we're uh, inside now. As you can tell, the place is mobbed the way it should be. This one's going on for a couple hours already. So I'm just going to hang out, get a chance to talk with a few people. I'm not quite sure what all this is over here, but we're going to probably find out. But like I said, this is a special celebration of the life of Mary Ann Kaur. It's also a fundraiser for her scholarship. And I think it's going to be something really special, so let me just walk around and see what I can find out. Thank you. Fantastic. Thank you for doing what you're doing. Thank you. Mr. Mayor, how are you today? Great, Wayne. How are you? This is a fantastic situation going on. Your thoughts about being here? Well, it's a great uh, thing that the Fairland Athletic Club is doing for the uh, Marion Moore Scholarship Fund, raising funds here tonight at the Fairland AC. Uh, you know, it's 13 years, but, uh, you know, Marianne will always live on in our hearts. Uh, she was a very good friend of mine, a great person, and, and uh, tragically she was murdered. And, you know, we're, we uh, made a pact in Fairland that we will always remember her. And, and here tonight, this is a great thing to have her legacy keep going on. No, I understand it's a fundraiser for a scholarship. What does the scholarship entail? You know? Well, yeah, it's for uh, Fairland High School seniors. It's okay. for a uh, boy and a girl. And um, actually, my daughter, years ago, when she graduated from Fairland High School, did win that scholarship, which I was I was very proud of her. And I, I was very happy because Marianne meant so much to me and to our community. And uh, so every year, the Fairland PBA awards two scholarships in the name of Marianne to uh, two worthy Fairland High School seniors. You know, I understand that from time to time, there are certain uh, retired policemen, firemen that are acting as bartenders. And also from time to time, we have some other special people acting. And now, am I going to be uh, seeing you back here doing your chores or what? Yeah, yeah. I'm I might. I'm going to get back to my college days as a bartender. And, college uh, days, okay. I'm going to be uh, on the uh, next shift here. Okay, So I'm, I'm looking forward to that. And uh, just want to thank, I mean, if you can see by this crowd of people here to support from yeah, uh, I know. all over the community, you know, all the emergency service people who, you know, when Marianne died, it brought all of the emergency services so close together. You know, we have a bond that can never be broken. And, and I, I'm so proud of the, uh, our police officers, our fire department, EMS, rescue squad, everyone's here tonight to uh, raise money in, in Mary Ann's name. And she deserved it. That's why this town of Fairland is so cool. I mean, I cover a lot of events throughout the year. This is on the top of my list. It you know, really Wayne, uh, I always tell you, Fairland is a big town with a small town attitude, and uh, we had a great feeling of community in our in our place. And, yeah. and Mary Ann was part of our community. A wonderful person. If you, if you knew her, you loved her, and uh, you know she had an art, hard exterior, but a, a heart of gold. So, but uh, so we're all really happy to be here tonight. And I want to thank you for coming down. And uh, always. So look, I'm going to give you a couple of minutes to get yourself ready for your next uh, obligation, so to I'm, speak. I'm all I'll ready. I'll be in a little while. Okay. And thank you for doing everything that you do for our town, too, Mr. Mayor. Thank Thanks, you. Wayne. Have okay. a great night. Yes, you too.
much about being here. Come on, tell me. Great fundraiser for a great lady. Yeah. Yes. And I always see that you're involved with a lot of the stuff that the town does too. Absolutely, absolutely. I'm very proud of the town I grew up in, and I'll support any fundraiser that they have. Thank you for being you. Thank you, Wayne. Thank you. Never yet. Never turn around. I got to say hi to you too. Hello. All right. Your thoughts about being here today? How do you feel about this? Well, it's all about Marianne. You know, you gotta, you gotta support everything. You know. Thank you for being here. Thank you for being here. Okay. Your thoughts about being here for Marianne? How do you feel about it? It's just this? amazing. You know, I, I walked in the door and it's going so strong. I heard it's been going strong since 3 p.m. I know it's going to go way past midnight. Yes, I think so. And it's just amazing the show of support for such an important cause. You know, no matter how many years go by, we have to still remember and do everything we can. Um, the scholarship fund going, keep her memory alive. Like, she would be so proud. I think she would also understand that we all just love her and it'll never go away. Exactly. I just want to say thank you for all the stuff that you do, because I don't always get an opportunity to chat with you, and you've been part of this community and doing some wonderful things, and it's in my hat, too. Keep up, keep up the good work, too. Thank you so much. Thanks, Wayne, for making sure we get this recording. Now, uh, go mingle for a while. I will. Thank, thank you very much for your time. Thank, thank you. you. Surely. No, Congratulations. <laughs> the last time I saw you, we were doing something with uh, over at JJ's with a pig roast, that right? was in October a long time ago. Yep. And how long ago it was? Yep. I was cooking a pig, now I'm bartending. Go figure. And it was a fantastic experience, by the way. I, I never covered anything like that before. I think it was a fantastic thing I'm that you guys you did. Enjoy. It was actually good food, too. Go figure. Huh? Let's talk about tonight. What are you doing here tonight? We really have a good time tonight. Uh, for Officer uh, Marianne Kalora. Um, Died on the job, you know, so a uh, great sense of community. So many years after, her legacy, her memory, her personality has never been forgotten. So we have a good opportunity to do something great for her legacy and her scholarship fund. Now, I understand that you're on the executive board of the AC now? I I'm a trustee. How'd that happen? I was elected, go figure. On a purpose? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. A slim majority voted for me to, to represent this organization. So the um, Fairmore Athletic Club has been around since 1923. And uh, there's a group of trustees that run the organization. Right. Made up of members, but run, uh, the business aspect is run by uh, the trustees. I am one of 11 of the uh, elected lucky members to uh, to make the place a good time. Well, I think you do that wherever you go, which is why I like to talk to you about stuff I like try. that. Now, you're going to be attacked by somebody on your left here any uh, second. Uh, I don't know. Uh, my right, your left. Should I say hi uh, Johnny Rule. John. Yeah. Hello, Mr. Wayne. How are you, buddy? What do you guys wear? Let me see those shirts. There you go, there you go. Well, listen, you, you're here now, you gotta say hi to everybody. Hello everybody. I just wanna say what's going on here tonight for the Marianne Kalora Scholarship. It's really, really unbelievable. All the restaurants that donated, all the guys that donated their time. And just look at the bar, Wayne. You I know, it. I know. It's, it's fantastic. really unbelievable what's going on. And we just wanna thank the town and all our friends and family to donate to this great opportunity today. Isn't Fairlawn a great borough? Fairlawn's the great, best borough. I grew up here. I lived out here for eight years when I was in the service. Vegas for a year. This town is the best. And so I came back because I care about people. We care about people. I know, I know. And we all care about Marianne and all the police officers that don't that that serve us and take care of us. I think, thank you, everyone. I think another time I want to come back and hear about your Las Vegas year, but that's another story. Yes. <laughs> thank you both, guys. Get back thank to work. I'll go with you guys soon. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thanks, Mike. Thank you. Keep on going, Mr. Mayor. Keep on going. All right, just in case 
I'm not quite sure. I, I spoke to May before. He told me he's going to be behind the bar, and there he is, helping out like everybody else is. Absolutely. We got a couple of uh, firemen on uh, the fire chiefs back there too, I think. Yeah, right. And I'm going to get her doing this so we can get a double shot. <laughs>with me and you've been seeing an incredible activity going on here at the Fair on AC. Obviously you know why we're all here and I think a lot of the people that I'm looking at right now may have something to do with it. So I'm going to start over here. So what's your name? Louis Evangelista. And tell me your involvement. I was a guest bartender. I retired after 30 years at the Fair Police Department. I was friends with Marianne for 25 years. 20 fantastic. How do you years. feel about being here like this? What's I wouldn't like? miss it. I wouldn't miss it. Thank you for being here. Thank you. Sir? How are you? Dave DeLuca, president of the Athletic Club. Your thoughts about today? Uh, it's just a great day, and we're happy to do it. Get together with the PBA and the police department, the town, 
and uh, do something great for Marianne in memory of her. Thank you. Thank you. Hello, and your name? Hi, Karen Sensulo. And your involvement? I'm the president of the Marianne Kalora Scholarship Foundation. Your, your thoughts about being here today? Excuse me? Your thoughts about being here today? Oh, it's a wonderful day. There's so many people that showed up. Um, so many people to thank for all their efforts, all their time that they put into it. It was a great day. Thank you, too. Great day for the scholarship. Scoot, I'm going to come back to you. Okay. Sir. Mark Palmieri, chairman. I organized this event today. And again, your, your, your thoughts? I, overwhelming response. Great from the outreach of uh, the Borough of Fairlawn, all the restaurants and all the people here. Very well assisted and uh, we raised nice money for the place. Scooter, I saved you for last because there's a couple other things I want to really get involved in. By the way, we're going to call you Bob Young for a moment because due respect there. Sure. We've got a lot of feedback from a lot of people that actually helped out with the food. With Give me some, a couple of thank yous there. First, uh, say hi to everybody. JJ's, the Dutch House, right. uh, Juicy Platters, Serenos, um, Benny's. Um, there's a whole bunch. Pork Help store. me out. Pork, pork store. store. Pork store, the Swiss yeah, pork yeah, store. Yeah, yeah. Nine iron. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Modern bagel. Geo. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Lucas. 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 And got, anybody got, I forget, I apologize. We got four part harmony. That's good. What are you holding in your hand? Uh, here we're Hold selling today. Today we're selling the, these glasses for ten dollars. Right. And the first drink is on the house. Okay. Over here we're selling the uh, booster stickers, five dollars a piece, to show that you came today. It's a nice mem mem memory of. And I think part of what we're really talking about that it's a scholarship fund, and it's in her honor and in her name. And I believe it goes for the people from the high school or a couple places. Do you have some feedback on that? It's from um, any senior actually from Fairlawn. Any senior, um, okay. Any senior in whatever high school they're in, as long as they put in a uh, application, they're qualified to uh, get the scholarship. When is that fi finalized? Is there still time for people to get involved with that? Has the different, uh, they have different rules or something recommendations, like Recommendations, rules or whatever. They end their they end their um, their time for scholarships at okay. certain times according to the school. All right, thank you for your energy too. All right, all you folks, I know you're still gonna go back inside, but I just want to give a little nod on my head and say thank you for everything that you've done. Thank you. We all love what thank we do you. here in Fairlawn. I think this is just one of those very special occasions. Thank you all very much. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you.